Give us an overview of the hole punch building blocks, please. So on the dog page, when you go to the dog page, you'll actually have an overview um, to begin with because we have a ton of stuff and there's a ton of stuff in this first batch and it can be very overwhelming. So we try to make it approachable by having an overview. You can get a little taste of what everything does, like the essentials of everything. We have this approach to modularity that's basically uh, says do one thing and do one thing well for each uh, individual building block. That means we have a ton of building blocks because we do a lot of things. You should then do one thing and one thing well. Um, so on the, on the side, you'll get an overview of all of it, but there will be um, sections for networking. That's what we call Hyperswarm. That's um, our networking toolkit for actually connecting uh, computers peer-to-peer, -peer, fully end-to-end encrypted, et cetera. Very, very powerful, very simple uh, to use. Obviously, very complicated machinery, but uh, that's for you to review and us for main to maintain. So that's exciting for everybody. We have our Hypercore Foundation, which is the foundational building block of all everything we do. The peer-to-peer -peer, um, data layer that moves data around uh, even... Um, between people and directly between people, all in trend, uh, authenticated and uh, uh, encrypted if you want to. Uh, we have all our tooling, we have our data structures, we have a thing called Hyperbeam, which is a very, very powerful database module that runs on top of the stack. So you can do basically uh, database queries. Again, tons of types type to continue. Of course, we have uh, our file system um, module called Hyperdrive, which is a really powerful um, file system extraction that allows you to basically share big chunks of data. And if you think about all the things I said, it's, it's probably all something you can tie back to individual features in Keat um, um, because we use it all there. So that's it's super exciting. Uh, and I'm sure Paolo can fill in some of the stuff I forgot. Yeah, so one of the um, most exciting and upcoming projects is actually Autobase. Um, so I think that these... Uh, uh, this module, this um, repository, will show exactly how kit chats are built. So with Autobase, you can um, it's, it's um, each peer in a kit chat in a, in a simplified form contains its own hypercore. So now with Autobase, you can create actually a chat history. You can see how you can organize and uh, verify and um, and uh, probably sort a group chat with tens, hundreds, thousands of people or peers participating into that chat. So it's a really cool consensus mechanism that works perfectly well with uh, um, peer to peer um, applications. So you can have peers that disconnect, reconnect, stay away for weeks and so on. And this auto based module has this scaffolding to create a really uh, complex um, uh, scenarios where you can have, again, peers that interact with each other, send ton of messages, files, share files, share videos, whatever, right, links, everything that you can imagine. But in the end, this data structure will collect all the information, will sort it, will decide the correct ordering of, of the data. Uh, of course, again, everything is verifiable because these are all IPOs. So, um, you can see that really um, Kit is just the scaffolding of everything that is already out there. So it's just like a nice you know, UI around um, uh, around tooling that has been developed over over years. So um, like Paolo was saying, and by the way, you know all this is you know very integrated with each other, and we, we spend a lot of time in the docs trying to cross reference everything. So when you read about Autobase, you can easily get access to reading about Hypercore and it all replicates through Hyperswarm and all these things. And, um, and I think that's one of the things that I'm very excited about having a, a single docs page for because it's all connected yet all modular. Um, it's super important for us to give people the first foundation to understand everything we're doing in our entire vision. And basically everything we do and everything we'll do from now on is building on these building blocks. So it's super important for us to get them out there, get them well documented, get everybody to look through it and start understanding that because if you don't understand this layer it's really really hard to understand the next layer we're doing so we, that's why we do these in like batches and this is the big foundational massive this is like 95 percent of how everything works and we'll we very excited to hear all the feedback and i think that it will be um extremely important i, I see how in you know two years three years from now these building blocks 
will be used in hundreds of thousands of applications, right? Could be like uh, small command line tools, like you can see Hyper SSH, Hyper Tele, like uh, they are DevOps tools, right? So for, for deploying things or for proxying, you know, your home uh, work connectivity and so on. But uh, there are, imagine how every single application that will be built on top of uh, Hole Punch will use these five, six, ten different projects. So it's critical that you, if you have any questions, if you, you know, you don't understand something, you find bugs, you find a way to improve it because, you know, this is open source stuff, right? So um, uh, it's battle tested but by us, but I'm pretty sure that uh, uh, many great co um, developers can contribute in, in making things even better. So. No, it's it's a community effort. Um, Matthias, myself, has been uh, a big believers in the open source movement since uh, many years ago. We contributed uh, with many um, projects, uh, open source projects ourselves. So, you know, it's uh, the reason. This this is actually the reason to 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 start with the building blocks. We want every one of you guys. Um, you guys, developers, to take a look at it and then start playing with it and, and break it if if you can. Also, we take we take uh, open source super seriously. It's not just open source. It's not a side feature for us. It's not something where we're like developing something and now it's open source and then we move on. Like we are, like it's in our blood open source. So it's super important for us to have proper open source. That means like documented flows. People can see the pull requests coming in and out. That we're actually doing it. That's not like two versions. This is it. And that's also why we're doing this foundational piece. So we, uh, you know, because we're gonna keep building on it because we need it every time we deploy. Keaton Hope Punch is the it's the latest version of all the building blocks. Um, so super exciting. Visit holepunch.to to view our documentation.